I like pan this like a bun. Guess what? We have some. Oh, cool. Yeah, she has. Tortitos de papa? Sim. Uh huh. She loves that. She's always asking. I just had one uh, yesterday. It was. Um, what do they call it? Uh, Inu and Vuelto or something like that. Yeah. It was like, it was like tuna uh -huh. wrapped around with uh, potato. Cool. I didn't know that. Because usually the Niño envuelto is a sweet bread, not yeah. with potato, but this time it was potato. Yeah, that was strange. It was at, uh, you know that place, a cafe, cafe that's right across the street yeah. from the school? Yeah. She made that. She has some good food. I like it. I didn't know. I haven't tried it. Every day. Raul, your turn. Yeah, she went for the water. <laughs> Um, because I, uh, I came here to do research for my master's, my maestria, and so, uh, I, did, I made a bunch of friends, and so I decided to come back. <laughs> I came here in 1985, 30, years ago, uh -huh. first time. She, she want to know if you have in mind how... Many times have you go and go back to Mexico to your to United States? How many times have uh, you go to United States and come A back? year, maybe once a year. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Okay. This whole year? Yes. Uh, I just uh, came back from Texas because my friend uh, got married. Cool. Uh. And so, <laughs> How old is he? Uh, he's it's a second marriage, and so he's he's about fifty years old. Fifty years old. Yeah. Still. Yeah, but uh, my wife died a uh, year and a half yeah. ago. Sorry. Yeah. So, uh, American? No, she was? she was from Puebla. Cool. Did uh, you ever have her as a? I didn't have classes, but they they said that it was she was pretty cool. Yeah. I didn't have the chance. She was mostly redacción and things like writing classes. And okay. And Any anything related with this course? Yeah. Okay. Anything related with uh, like. Uh, Linguistics or, linguistics or Diana, or Diana did. did. Diana yeah. had classes, yes, mm -hmm. and she liked. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, uh, Monica has something for. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Maybe I can give you a, a quiz. What is the name of that hill over there? What what sir? What is the name of that hill? Of oh, that hill. Okay. What is the name of the hill? No, that little know. cerrito over there. What is the name? Does anybody yeah. know? I know, the name but of that hill? I guess I you know. know yeah, I guess I know. So, do you they know? They do a lot of uh, mountain biking. Is it the Guadalupe Hill? No. No. Zapoteco. Zapotecas. Zapotecas. Uh -huh. Zapotecas. Yeah, that's right. They say that it's a forest inside of it, right? A little yeah, forest. Yes. Yes. I don't know. I haven't been up there in a long time. I don't know okay. whether they chop yeah. it down or not. But. Some friends comment that there was a special microclimate thing. Oh yeah, yeah. It was that a, I didn't know. Like a rainy some forest, pine trees, but uh, and then uh, the one behind that yeah? is the tecajete. Yeah, the tecajetes. Uh huh. The one that looks like it has two peaks, but it's really a crater. It's a volcanic. Uh, also, the Zapotecas is a volcano. <laughs> really? It's a volcanic uh, crater. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Looks like a hill, but. It's not alcohol, actually. Oh. It's one hundred percent alcohol. <laughs> but it's oh, from Zacatlan. Thank, thank you. So this is from everyone. Thank you. Just to say thank you. Thank you. It's a type of champagne, but a base of cidre. How do you say it? She said it's a base of manzana. She said that it's like it's actually cider, but they made it in a with a with a champagne process. I don't know. So it's a bubbly, bubbly, bubbly cider. So it looks like this, it follows the same railroad track as before. Yeah. That's where the railroad track used to be. Mm -hmm. They use it. So she was asking, what was that white building? Where was it? That one. Which one? That. The down, uh, down the hill next to the football soccer fields. This one. Huh. This little one. Oh, this, this one building. right here near yeah. the palm trees? Yeah. That used to be the the mental hospital. 
Yeah, that's what they mentioned. That, that was uh, the Hospital de Guadalupe, but now it's uh, they're going to make it into a museum or something. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. Cool. And that's another pyramid over there. Where? And over there. Uh, okay, let's see. And, uh, uh, that's another pyramid over there. And that's another pyramid over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mara, why don't you want? Why don't you ask him where does he live? Donde vive? To stop? because maybe you want to know where she's twelve. So she's been learning for one year. Oh, wow! Okay. And she's like, oh my god, I'm struggling. So that's why she needs practice. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo sería? ¿Dónde vives? Now, where are you from? Is the donde vives? Uh, where, where do you live? Perfect. Uh -huh. Where do you live? I live about two kilometers this way. Two <laughs> kilometers that way. Huh? I walked here from, from my house. Man, you're in shape, Scott. I didn't know that. You were, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's about two kilometers and a little bit more, I think. Like how many blocks? Like eight blocks? Uh, something like that, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's four. I live right behind the Udla. Oh, cool. So, do you have Udla's friends? No. Uh, a couple. A couple. A couple of some teachers. Okay, mostly teachers. Yeah.